Three days after a superb three-all draw at the Parc des Princes, Monaco faced Paris Saint-Germain again in the championship in a postponed week 15 fixture. With all the headlines complementing Monaco after their draw, the challenge for Roberto Moreno was to once more get a result against the league leaders with exactly the same team that played on Sunday. Thomas Tuchel, on the other hand, makes four substitutions for this match, including three in defence. Peñeda, who was brilliant at the Parc de Plas, tested Kayla Navas early on, but Angel Di Maria sent Kylian Mbappe on his way, and the French prodigy did not miss from close range. The former Monaco player, Mbappe, who made his grand debut with Monaco, opting not to celebrate the first goal, but it's a trademark finish for the Frenchman, who tucks the ball into the bottom corner. Monaco then responded with Jelson Martins, forcing another brilliant save from Kayla Navas. Thomas Tuchel had emphasized defense in his post-match interview when these two teams met at the weekend. But at the other end of the pitch, Kylian Mbappe was simply unstoppable. Leconte making a fantastic reflex save at his front post. The game decidedly went in PSG's favour after Levin Kozawa was deemed to have been fouled by Camille Glick. The replays showing it was minimal contact. But up stepped Neymar, who had scored a penalty at the Parc des Princes, and the Brazilian did not miss from the spot. Another cool, calm and composed finish to put the visitors two up at the Stade Louis II. Monaco kept on pushing to get a goal and bounced back in the game. But it was Paris who went in at the break. Two goals to the good. Plenty more action to come in the second half. Moreno's team perhaps lacking a little bit of fitness as they were exposed to the Parisian counter-attacks. Angel Di Maria once more setting Kylian Mbappe on his way. The Frenchman that time denied by an excellent save by Leconte. The keeper coming out, getting his angles right. Mauro Icardi made way for Sarabia and Marco Verratti. And it was the Italian who found his fellow substitute, Sarabia, at the back post to tuck in a beautifully constructed goal. Initially ruled out for offside. The goal was allowed to stand. Good decision by the referees in the VAR compartment. 3-0 to Paris. Three points in the bag as the Parisians continued their solitary charge at the top of the Ligue 1 Conferama standings. Monaco reduced the mark late on. Bakayoko turning the ball in after Kayla Navas made a rare mistake in the capital side goal. Bakayoko knew nothing about it, but it certainly was another good goal scored by the Principality team. But the show was stolen by Kylian Mbappe, who got his second of the night. This time sent on his way by Neymar and Mbappe with his left foot deadly from close range once more. 4-1, the final score in the south of France. PSG restore their eight-gap lead at the top of the standings over Marseille. Monaco remain in the top half of the table.